I'm John Proxy on Channel John of the West having a Final Fantasy XII international adventure. And uh, yes, I just had a cut scene. Uh, let's see if this man here wants to. He's a game hunter, that's, that's useful. Ah. Oh, it's not useful. Why did that come up? Okay, I reviewed that, um, uh, the, that last cut scene again. And so, there are six judges that I know of so far. Um, I'm going to say finish the sentence before I go through. Six judges. Let's have a look at the farm. Oops. Uh, there is uh, Judge Geese, who's dead. So that's an easy one to remember. Uh, there is Gabranth, which is uh, Bash's brother. So, um, and he seems to be loyal to Vane and Lassa. What am I doing here? But I had a really good reason I have gone. Uh, okay, so that's two. There is Drace. That's the woman. She seems to be very loyal to Larsa. And close to Cabranth. There is Zect, who went we haven't seen. He went missing right after Nabudis. Which was two years before the start of the game. Um, and there, there is um, Zagabath, who is that posh guy who is extremely loyal to Vayne. Uh, to the point that, you know, he, it looks like he might do things to other judges if they talk certain subjects. And there's that guy who looked like a dustbin, and I did not catch his name. Anyway, that's the six we know of. And I wonder if they've been put in the clan primer, because that'd be really useful if they could do that. Um, nope, just geese. We've not read this one. Being a great gigantic titan torse. Titan toys. Uh, that has assumed the aspect of boulders to rocks amongst them. It has matured. An unlikely story one might think until one considers that the average rock toys grows to adulthood over the course of several thousand years. These individuals kept as a pet until it ran off into the magicite mines one day, where it was transformed by the mason into something violent and wicked. Yeah. Uh, we've, we've seen this before. So those were elite toys. And, uh, yes. What's this? I've not fought this yet. Where the hell did I fight an arrows? Also, according to the, um... There we go, that's the rare game. According to the internet, that doesn't get unlocked until I kill that. So, I have no idea where the hell I killed that from. Uh, because that wasn't there before, so I must have bumped into it. I might have to review the videos. What the hell? Huh. Never mind. Strange. Alright, let's go into the jungle. So I meant to say, Welcome to the jungle! Oh, I'm, I'm really sorry for doing that. Yes, I know what the next two bosses are, because we fought them in the trial mode. Uh, well, not actually, not the next two, but two bosses we are. Ooh, it's the Cuppers. Oh, One. I don't even know if I've gone the right place or not. In Eastern Korea. I don't know where Eastern Korea is. Alright, let's just kill stuff for a while. <laughs> Let's 
going to be a map, obviously. Uh, it's always a map in those jars. Because... I don't know where I'm going. Let's go south. So I remember quite a lot of things about this game, but I don't remember the coming here yet. I've got a pun. I know it, it's uh, my priorities are not correct, but uh, you have this pun. Oh, why? But uh, well, that's block. Oh, cutscene. What is it? The jungle denies us our passage. What have we done? We? No. I... What's that mean? How are we supposed to get through that? Making an appearance. Come I on, am... I'm talking over here. I thought you'd left for good. Hey! Our choices are few. God, they know a friend. All fear! This is as much for you ah. as it is me. Oh? You are ill at ease. The Nethersite troubles you. You've let your eyes betray your heart. Right. What it's are you doing? Hot gold, really. She's using the connect. Soon you will learn. Whoa. Why do you ever use that in combat? We go to seek aid of the Viera who dwell ahead. I bet they'll be glad to see you after so long. She was listening, was she? I am unwelcome. An unsought guest in their wood. Fair enough, let's go! For the Viera party. Let's go to the Bunny Mansion. In the village ahead, you will find her, Mjern. Bring her to me. She will know why you call her. You can just go get her with yourself. No? Muggles! Aren't you glad that I saved up loads of money now? Aren't you? You are, aren't you? You're all glad. Ooh, I need to Uh. Ah, oh, it's so expensive. I know she's not one of my main teams. Look, I've, I've barely used the bar. Ooh, hang on. Staff rod. Okay. Well, that helps a bit, I suppose. Let's see if any of these other ones I want. Nope. Get 
get a Suna and Fire. Buy some armor off you, buddy. Yes, I know. decent shield, so don't worry about that. Which one is more useful than I think we should do? There we go, that's pretty much all our money gone. How many of those things are things I bought? Like the gold armor. Uh, more importantly, we can tell them. Which is nice. Let's take some orange. I should have timed that sip better, but I might. Let's go in to the village. Although there was though there are those out there who call it heaven. They're like elves, but with much more fetish on top. This is not our warrior, so I'm guessing that's not a warrior. But, um... I didn't, I've not said anything in ages. I don't know what I can say. I'm in the village of bunny women. Somebody out there went, right, I want to create a race. Okay, what race? Elves? Okay, but elves already exist. You can't have elves. This is Final Fantasy with Japanese. What about Vulcans? No, can't have Vulcans. They exist in Star Trek. It's got nothing to do with anything. Well, well what then? What about bunny women? You what? Bunny women, yes. Well, what we do is we make sort of playboy thin models, dark skin, rabbit ears. It's a race. They're warriors with magic and stuff. They're elves. And they're bunny women. 
And somebody, somebody heard this and went, "Yes, yes, this is a decision that I will go with." Uh, also, I'm trying to find a lady. Just go. I like the idea of rabbit women. That's what he said. The Do they wear trousers? No! That, it's, uh, it's far too hot for them to wear clothes. They must have their bums out at all times. Sure oh, they are bunny women. Where the hell am I going? But even the warriors, yes, especially the warriors. Okay, the warriors are wearing skirts. But, uh... It's Mion. Ooh, I thought Mion might be back here. What the hell? Where am I going? I'll try going up again. Alright, that's the end of my rant as well. No more rant. It's getting silly. Did I miss her? Let's talk to you. The Thane, the Thane of the village. Seriously, put some trousers on. <laughs> just the, the, the rabbit tail is on the right, it's just like two squares. I'm guessing there's a graphical break. Hey, Mjern lives here, doesn't she? We're here to see her. You will leave at once. It is not allowed for humans to walk on these grounds. We'll go as soon as we've seen Mjern. If you can find her. We're not leaving until you let us see her. <laughs> Who the hell's letting Vaughn speak? Fine then. We'll look for her ourselves. He's Mjern. He's the only one dressed ah. differently. I've heard the voice of the wood. She says Mjern is not in the village. Oh, Jyote, where has she gone? Why do you ask? The wood tells us where she has gone. Or can you not hear her? You cannot. Your ears are dull from hearing their harsh speech, I think. Viera, who have abandoned the wood, are Viera no longer. Mjörn, too, has left her embrace. And you forsake them in turn? It is the will of the village. Viera must live always with the wood. So is the green word, and so is our law. I know we'll let you worry about keeping your laws. Just do us a favor and stay out of our way. We'll find her ourselves. I don't want to be crass, but I'm just wondering how, um... Well, how they exist. Do they, are they spores? Do they summon more from the planet Viera? Where, the, where do the bunnies come from? I have all these questions, and they're not going to answer any of them. Our sister has left the wood and gone west. She wanders warrens among men who hide themselves in clothes of cold iron. Of the Thus west. to me has the wood spoken. The Viera may begin as part of the wood, but the wood is not the only end we may choose. The same words I heard fifty years ago. Yeah, so they obviously have quite the longevity. So, uh, what am I doing now? Uh, it's about for getting to the next cutscene coming in, apparently. Oh, that's just cruel. Don't give me haste and have me not be able to use it.
Where is it? So Fran can use... Oh, look at it! It's just there being all hasty. Not usable. But she can use fire, so I should actually uh, put that in at some point. No haste. It's frustrating. What does he have some stuff? Right. Yeah. So, uh... Yeah, I have all these questions about this society. How, how the hell it works. Because at the moment it looks like I'm in, like, a kind of, sort of, jungle thing brothel. I don't know, this is something that doesn't sit right with me with these people. Try and leave the way I mean, because, you know, elves are supposed to feel like they're otherworldly, like they're wise beyond their things. And it doesn't quite work with bunny people, because they kind of they feel like a fetish. Anyway, I don't know if I'm going to be able to find them, so I'm going to cross over here and save. Let's see. Let's go beyond the black, beyond the black screen. Oh, there is a cutscene. Might as well watch then. Not bad, Vaughn. Didn't think we'd get any information out of that one. So then, what was she saying about men in a warren? The Henna Magicite mines. Maybe that's what she meant. They lie in Bangor, south of the Osmoan Plain. The entire region is a colony of the Arcadian Empire. There would be soldiers. Is that a problem? Let's move. Friend. Yes? I this was is wondering a perfectly valid question, what Yote said, you know, about how you said the same thing 50 years ago. Your point? Uh, how old were you again? I mean, he doesn't know. Uh, nice fun. Oh, surprisingly rude. Try to grow up, please. I don't get what's wrong with that question. I know. I, 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 the joke is, you know, you're supposed to ask women their ages. And, uh, yeah, yeah. But this is a race that he's never bloody encountered before. Like, once you're 50, you're at least 50 because you look much younger. Um, which, is, you know, that's a compliment as well. But uh, I don't know. It just is annoying me. It annoys me that 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 seems like a perfectly valid question to ask, uh, given the situation. Yeah, he asked him in a stupid manner, but still. Anyway, I'm John Fox and I'm John West having a Final Fantasy XII International Zodiac Job System Adventure. I'll see you next time.